Warning, the following video contains scenes of explicit violence, sexual deviancy, profanity, and just bad humor. Viewer discretion is advised. Last time on Cry of Fear. Good, I will. I don't want you to have a gun. He killed- he shot me anyway! That asshole! And now, the next episode. Welcome back, we're here at the phone. Ah. Well, Brony Nerds and Gamers, we, uh, my name is Drummy. And we're here again. Nine seven seven nine. Well, that's weird. Thank you for letting me know. I guess that's the password to get up to the roof. Nine seven seven nine. Okay. Cool. We're playing Cry of Fear. The doctor has locked the door. Uh. We use the tablet here. To uh, to get up and we, to get up, we use the tablet for the phone number to call the number, which led over to there, which gave us the password. Uh, it's just so convoluted. It's kind of ridiculous. Five one one seven eight eight one six. Now we got the our Remington shotgun back. It's stupid that we have to do this all without uh, a flashlight, and I hate putting you guys through this, but. As I explained, there we go. We get to save up here, and uh, now we get to try to feel our way. There it is, nine seven seven nine, and then we move through. See, simple enough. Take the gun. Take the magazine, take the syringe. Oh, I that's a boss fountain. That is a boss fountain if I've ever seen a boss fountain. Oh, this is this is definitely P345. Oh, hey. That's the other gun, isn't it? Um Uh we could keep that gun, couldn't we? Since he doesn't have a gun to fight with, uh, fight us with. Uh, but what do I want to take? Or what do I want to leave? I think we'll drop the shotgun. Uh, reload this. What is, what kind of gun is this? Uh, a solid, high-powered handgun that packs a real punch. We'll use this to kill the doctor. Because, uh, you know, spoiler, we're going to fight the doctor. It's just, I just know. So, save here. I swear to God, though, if that shotgun isn't there when I get back. Excuse me. Excuse me. There we go. If that shotgun's not there when I get back, I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be so pissed. Yeah, here we go. Another syringe. Thank you. Easy there. Easy there. Don't be crazy. Just take the shots you can. Just... Hello? Thank you. This is going to be a long battle. I'm not going to play around. I'm... Fuck. I'm gonna let him make. Need to heal. Uh, set that to two. Set that to one. Set that to three. There we go. Come out, doctor. I just want to say hello. Is that so bad? Come. 
Come on out, doctor. Air doctor, I'm calling for you. Do you want to say hello? I want to say hello. You should stop say hello. You should come say hello right now. Just just peep on through. I know this is cheap. I know this is cheap. I know this is cheap and I know this is going to take a long time. But I'm not wa I'm not wasting any time on this guy. I'm not wasting any life on this guy. This guy is an ass. He's a dick. He's been the dick of my bane existence ever since I first saw him. Come on. You know you want to come back over here. Here he, go there he goes. Come on. You know you want to. You know you want to do this. You want to go back to that box and try to get the jump on me, but you won't. You won't do it because I'm way too smart for you. I'm way too smart. I'm way too smart for you. I'm way too smart for you. Way too smart for you. Way too smart. I'm way too smart for you. Don't you know that I'm way too smart for you? Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, poor doctor. The pills by itself won't make you feel better. You have to do something more than that. I recommend it that you try a new mode of treatment called cognitive therapy. What's that? Well, it's a set of exercises you do. A way to forget the past. All the bad memories and anxiety you have. Are you interested in books, Simon? I don't know. Why? All right. I just wanted to find out because I want you to try out something. I want you to write a book, a book about how you feel. Do you think you can do that? I guess so. I can try. That hurt. That must have hurt. Chapter 7. Only safe at home. Well. Ah, uh, revolver. Drop that. Pick up the revolver. Oh, come off it. Give me my bag back. I, ah. Uh, uh, come on. Don't make me choose. Where's the door? Okay, I know where the door is. So here's what we'll do. We'll drop the revolver. Pick up the back door key. We'll go use the key. Come back here. Pick up the revolver. We'll leave the Glock, I guess. I don't know what I'm supposed to leave. Oh. Birds are chirping. How nice. The door is locked. Oh, the door is locked. Excuse me. Excuse me, I'm trying to get... Excuse me, I'm trying to find... Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah. There we are. Bloody fucking key to the back door, it says. Uh, we'll drop the other gun there and take that. 
And we'll save here just so that we can make sure we don't fuck anything up. Now we'll find this back door. Wherever it might be. Is this it? No, that's the staff quarters. Uh it's probably on the it's probably on the first floor. I'm willing to bet. Excuse me. Uh excuse me. At least there's no Oh, uh, at least there's no more monsters running around. Can't complain about that. But now I don't even know where to go. Let's see, lock is smashed. It's probably around here somewhere. Uh Hello? 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 Where is this back door? I I can't I would never think that I would meet the day that I would actually say I wish I had like a GPS system for this game that tells me where the next objective is. I would never think I would actually think that, but I'm starting to feel that way. It's just it's just everything's in such weird spots. Now, I know we just killed the doctor and all, but let's be honest. This is probably some drug-induced uh, uh, paranoia of Simon, and actually, the doctor is quite nice, and killing him is like a representation of how much we hate how much he's helping us or something, something weird like that. Um, it's kind of... I don't want to say it's obvious, because it's not really obvious, but it's kind of explained of what's going on. It's, it's kind of easy to understand, as long as you uh, are paying attention. Um, uh, clearly, lock is smashed, won't budge. Clearly, it's not as simple as monsters running about. I mean, I, I hope I'm not spoiling that for anybody who's watching this. If you're, if you were worried about spoilers, that door's locked. Why is? No. I had the shotgun. Wait. Wait, the shotgun! The shotgun's in there. Wait. The. the what? What the? What? How am I? How am I systematically? Oh, for... I guess it was some kind of glitch and they fixed it by, um... Ha. Huh. Okay, fine. Where's the back door? Alright, alright, alright. That gun's still there. Let's look around here for a bit. That gun's still there. Uh, doctor's still here. What's that? That's the revolver. Okay. The P345 is there. The revolver's there. How many syringes do I have? Oh, I got three syringes. I no way I'm giving that up. Four syringes? Oh, Glock magazine. I fucking have that. I, I have four syringes. If you add that together with the syringes from my bag, I got like eight syringes. I must be playing on easy mode. I must be playing on easy mode because there's no way I'm this good. I'm not this good at video games. Maybe I am. What if I am? Lock is smashed. Lock is smashed. Uh, oh, this way? No. I just, do I have to try every... Lock is smashed. There's nothing here. It, it, am I missing something? I, I By the time you leave a comment, I'm sure this is already going to be done. But, 
what am I missing here? Where's the the missing link? Can't go through that door. Uh, go back down to the first floor. Oh, this is the basement, isn't it? Oh, this is the first floor. Okay. Can't go through there. Lock is smashed. Lock is smashed. Uh, nothing here. You know, let me give my only one complaint about this game. Um, the game is great because it challenges you at every corner. It doesn't just allow you to walk around all free and clear. There's the, there it is. Alright, so now that door is unlocked. Now we'll come back up. Uh, we'll drop this here. Come back up. Uh, pick up that. Pick up the Glock. Uh, and do we need the Glock? Or would we rather keep the other two guns? Um, this is empty. This is empty, so there's no reason. There's no reason to keep it. So we got the Glock, syringe, and the Magnum. We lost the shotgun. Good old Remington. I'm sorry. Remington has Remington has served us so well throughout this entire game. In our darkest moments when things have been craziest, he has come and, and helped us in the light. And we have syringes. Ah, oh, we're just doing so well. Unfortunately, I think all the easy time is about to end things are about things are about to get crazy hard I'm sure find your way home yeah things look very bright and colorful and glorious well bright and colorful and glorious in comparison to half uh, to uh, to cry of fear uh, in comparison to Half-Life 2, it's pretty on par. It's actually pretty bleak compared to Half-Life 2, which was the engine it's based off of. I can't see shit. Well, thank you for letting me get the revolver rounds without any problem. I appreciate that at least. I appreciate the daytime and the lack of need for a uh, for a flashlight. I wonder if it was supposed to be that way because you have all these lamps around here. I wonder if they originally intended it to be at in daytime. I mean at night. Ah, the lake. What a nice lake. Oh, that's a very pretty lake. This is very pretty scenery. The development, the guys who worked on this, and I don't mean that by like just specifically genders of guys, but it's obviously a lot, a lot of guys worked on this, but a lot of pe the people who worked on this did a fantastic job and really know how to put uh, uh, scenery and how to make things look real with the uh, limited kind of technology that they had to work with. And that's that I think is pretty incredible. So now we get in the boat. Use movement keys to move the boat. Use key to disembark. Uh is this for real? Are we gonna have to like fight something? I can't are you going to have me fight something? Are you serious? Is this a serious thing you're going to do? Can I just have my bag back? I want my bag. I want to be able to carry six things again. Oh. Do you guys see that? Everything's changing very quickly. 
Oh, gosh. Well, Simon, it's just you and me. Sitting in this boat. Traveling across the pond. Yep. This is my life. So, I guess it's safe for me to reveal, since it's probably, it has probably already begun. By the time this video comes out, this has already begun, so it's actually safe for me to, um, uh, to mention that the next, uh, Let's Play I'm, uh, planning is Deadly Premonition. And for those of you who, <laughs> for those of you who know about, uh, 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 Two Best Friends Play and how they played Deadly Premonition, oh, it... I am I am really looking forward to it. It's not just going to be me. It's going to be me and about uh, one or two friends of mine. They're not bronies themselves, which uh, is fine. But um, it's going to be a lot of fun, and I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, if you haven't been able to guess, I uh, I record these videos. I'm recording these videos like in a straight line, and so I'm not actually oh, more rain. I'm not actually. Um, by the time when, when this is actually uploaded, it's probably going to be uh, maybe two or three weeks from now, from the point where it actually got recorded. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not sure how many episodes we have right now. Ah. Uh, oh, look at all that. Oh, more P345 ammo. Well, that's unfortunate that I didn't take the P345 then, I suppose. But you know what? You didn't give me a bag. You don't you're not giving me a bag to use. So I don't know what you're expecting. Um what am I supposed to do? Is it this way? Here we go. Yeah. Thought you could get a drop on me, didn't you? Yeah, come on. Come on. Just just bring it all out. Just bring it all out. Come on. I know you're out there. Which way am I supposed to go? This is not cool. Come on! Give me more inventory space! Fine. I, I I have no choice. Let's uh do a wield with this. Oh, you're even giving me more revolver rounds. And ammo. Oh, this is not cool. Was I supposed to find a did I miss something? Did I miss something? Maybe I did. Maybe I missed the bag. Oh, that would suck. Oh, man, but I'm getting tons of syringes. All right, here we go. Here we go. Uh, all right. All right. There's the revolver. Uh... Son of a bitch. Alright. Uh, another syringe. See, I can't. I cannot give up that many syringes. I can't. But I want another gun. I guess I gotta make the decision. Do I Do I keep... Where is it? Where, where is it? Where is the revolver? Is it here? Where is it? Where's the revol Where did the revolver go? It was right here. It was. It was. It was right here. It was right. It was right here. 
It was literally right... It was right there. No, here it is. Okay. Uh, we'll drop this here. We're going to do this... We're going to do this real sneaky-like. Yeah, I know. Look at that! I got 20... 25 revolver bullets. It, it's... I know this is a terrible abuse of whatever, but, um, I just, I don't know what to do. I don't, I don't care. I, I'm not leaving both those guns behind. Yeah, there we go. It's it's light down here. See, look at that. I, there's no way I can give that up. I can't see down here. Huh. Wonder what this is for. Excuse me. Excuse me. Easy. Oh, look. That's nice. Hello? Look at that. Two shots. Dead. Oh. Excuse me. Oh, come on! Alright, here we go. Down here. Shoot. Go, go through that porthole. That's just not funny. Alright, 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 alright. Let's go! Ow, damn it! That's not cool. That's not cool at all. That is not cool. Hey, we can crouch while swimming in the water. Ah, uh, that's kind of weird. Alright, whatever. Uh, this way, right? No, this, this way. Oh, come on, come on. Excuse me! Come on! This is, this is absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Alright, alright, we're good. We're safe, we're good, we're safe, we're safe and good. Pistol train downward just in case someone decides to be a dick and include f swimming monsters in this game. Uh, hold on. Oh, there's two ways here. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. I got turned around. Alright, we'll go this way.
Come on. There we go. I don't know if this is the right way, but we're gonna go this way. <laughs> that looks so weird bobbing around while crouched. Alright. Is this it? Ah! That's it. Alright. That's the end of this episode. Join us again next time here on Brody Nerds and Gamers. We'll play more of Cry of Fear. Leave a like or comment below if you enjoyed the video. Uh, and please don't yell at me too much for... for not keeping the flashlight, but damn it. Until next time, good night.